हेलो फ्रेंड्स हियर वी हैव अ सिस्टम ऑफ इक्वेशंस x plus y plus z is equal to 18 and x square plus y square plus z square is equal to 108 and i'm going to solve for x y and z so here we have first equation is x plus y plus z is equal to 18 and the second equation is x square plus y square plus z square is equal to 108 so first of all i will square equation number one which is x plus y plus z square and its right hand side is 18 square okay we know that x plus y plus z whole square is same as x square plus y square plus z square plus 2 times xy plus yz plus xz and it is equal to 18 square same as 324 and it is also given in equation number 2 that x square plus y square plus z square is equal to 108 so it will be 108 plus 2 times xy plus yz plus xz is equal to 324 okay just uh, take this 108 to the right hand side so it will become 2 times xy plus yz plus xz is equal to 324 minus 108 is same as 216 okay now remove this 2 from here by dividing 2 on both sides so xy plus yz plus xz will be equal to 108 as we know that this equation number 2 x square plus y square plus z square is also equal to 108 if right hand sides of both equations are equal that means its left hand side will also be equal so we can write it as x square plus y square plus z square will be equal to xy plus yz plus xz okay now what should i do here to find the values of x y and z so first of all i will multiply whole equation with 2 so it will become 2x square plus 2y square plus 2z square is equal to 2 times xy plus 2 times yz plus 2 times xz okay now i can rearrange this equation as this 2x square can be written as x square this 2x square can be written as x square plus x square plus y square plus y square and 2z square can be written as z square plus z square now i will take this uh, right hand side to the left hand side so it will be negative 2xy negative 2yz negative 2xz and it will be equal to 0 okay now if i will combine this x square and this y square and this negative 2xy then what will it give us it will give us a perfect square of x minus y whole square now if I will combine this y square, this z square and this 2yz, it will also give us a perfect square y square plus z square minus 2yz. Plus x square plus z square minus 2xz and it is equal to 0. Now we know that it is equal to x minus y whole square and it will be equal to y minus z whole square and it will be equal to x minus z whole square and it is equal to zero okay now you can see that some of the square is equal to zero that means x minus y will be equal to zero y minus z will be equal to zero and x minus z will also be equal to zero so x minus y whole square is equal to zero and y minus z whole square will be equal to 0 and x minus z will also be equal to 0. So from here x will be equal to y, y will be equal to z and z x will be equal to z. 
if x is equal to y and y is equal to z and x is equal to z, it will give us x is equal to y is equal to z. So, what will be the values of x, y and z if all these three variables are equal? As we know that in the given equation, x plus y plus z is equal to 18. So, it will be so, if x, y and z are equal, that means x, y and z are equal to 6. If x, y and z are equal to 6, so will it satisfy this equation x square plus y square plus z square is equal to 108? Obviously, 6 is 36, 36 and 36. When we will add these three 36, so it will give us 108. That means the values of x, y and z is equal to 6 for this problem. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe my channel. Do comment and share. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.